TNA is like, I saw you on Wrestlelicious. Here's our contract and like sent me a big contract. And they wanted me to be like the sub for Angelina Love who had been deported to Canada. And I'm like, oh, okay. So um, I, 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 I emailed Jimmy Hart. I showed him everything. And he was like, well, honey, you know, that's better than we can offer. Okay, go ahead and do it. You know, he's so sweet. And I was like, okay, well, because I didn't have a contract. But I didn't even know I was doing anything with them. I thought it was a music video. So I never had signed anything. Anyway. Mm. So I go with TNA. And then uh, I'm with TNA. And I'm the Von Eric family. I'm all about kayfabing and like really getting into your character and like you if you don't like someone like in your character like you're not supposed to like them publicly everything right you can't be seen with them nothing that's what i think wrestling is like there's no like you fight on camera and then you're friends in real life that's that's not how i grew up like you fight on camera you hate them in real life and you show it you do public displays and it's on the newspaper like that's how i grew up wrestling so anyway i get angelina love's position as the beautiful people and they're like well um have you heard about angelina love and i'm like oh yeah i heard she was a terrible girl da, 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 da. and like i say all this bad stuff knowing that i'm a heel and I'm supposed to do that. And then the Federation calls me like, why are you being so mean about Angelina Love? And I'm like, wait, what happened to wrestling? <laughs> I thought we were supposed to do that. What do you think about that, Hannibal, of these days? Uh, I think they are supposed to do that. And that's one of the problems today. Now, as far as the... Uh the beautiful people thing with Angelina Love and the other. How did it go when Angelina came back? Did you have heat? Like in real life, or do you want me to do a wrestling? No, program? in real life. You can come oh. oh, I'm sorry. Did I just stab you in the head? I know. Um, no, so uh, when I first saw her, she obviously knew what I said about her and like radio, newspapers, blah, blah, blah. If there's newspapers back then, I don't know. Me? No, not you. I know, I'm so famous. And um, and I could tell she was, like, hurt or taken back by it, which is also, like, super annoying because the, I find out later, you know, the Ric Flair, Von Eric, uh, like, rivalry, right? And I find out later that Rick and my family were super close and best friends. So when Angelina comes in and she's like, why would you say that about me? It was like, wait, do y'all not know what wrestling is? Like, cause I just came from the eighties to the two thousands, like abruptly. And I didn't realize like what a change it was. It was like, what a like non kayfabe, like, wait, we're supposed to be publicly not okay with each other. Da, da, da. So I feel like once she understood me, like, look, this is how it's supposed to be. Wait, and this is how it is. She was like, she was more understanding and nice toward me. And then Lauren and I, that's her real name, became really good friends. And I love her so much to this day. Thank you for watching the Hannibal TV. Please like this video if you enjoyed it. And click the subscribe button to not miss any of our latest shoot interviews match videos, or news updates. Support us on Patreon.com for $1.99 a month to watch our full shoot interviews ad-free and help our channel grow. Follow us on Twitter at The Hannibal TV for instant updates.